Emily Downey, Claudia Frangipani, Ruby Harold, Lewis Smith, Amy Tinkler, Christian Thomas, Max Whitlock, Nile Wilson, Nathan Bailey, Kat Driscoll, Bryony Page, joining them on stage are their coaches and support staff. Running quite right as well. The most successful Team GB gymnastic team of all time, ladies and gents. Um, yeah. I'm going to have a chat with a few. Let's start with uh, Max, if I could just pull you out a second there. We had to wait a while to, to get a gold uh, in this sport. You went one, and then within an hour, you went another one. I spoke to you just after. Um, how do you feel now on reflection? Um, pretty much exactly the same. I uh, it hasn't sunk in yet, so I don't think it'll be. Uh, I don't think it'll sink until we get home. Uh, we're all feeling up to the top of the world. Nile and Amy finished off brilliantly today, and uh, like you say, we can stand here feeling the best we've ever felt in, in a, long, a long, long time, and uh, the most successful we've ever been. Uh, you said that you have to wait for everyone to finish, like you mentioned, Nile and, and Amy as well. You can all celebrate together now, can you? Definitely, yeah. We all waited, and now we can go. You know, like I said, we could be so, so proud, and, uh, and what we've done deserves a big celebration. Max, we're like everybody. Gosh, you're so shy, but unfortunately, you have to talk to me right now. Um, 16 years of age, the youngest athlete out of the 366 in Team GB. How do you cope with that pressure? It was incredible. Just kind of just said to just go out and enjoy it, and yeah, I did. <laughs> we all enjoyed watching you as well. It's a bronze medal. Can you quite believe that? Not at all. It's still not something. It's pretty amazing. Uh, and a bit different to most. Um, you win a bronze medal, and of course, what you do now is go home and you wait for your GCSE results. <laughs> yeah, I get my GCSE results the day after I get back. Confident. What a bronze medal. Ladies and gentlemen, Amy. It's almost like you did two Olympics, amazing consistency. How are you feeling uh, now you've had time to reflect? It's, uh, it's amazing, you know, coming here, seeing everyone's smiles and you know, being here with the team and, and you know, finishing off today like the way we did. It's just been an, uh, an incredible honour uh, to be part of this team, to be part of the whole movement the last decade. And, uh, you know, we just want to thank everyone for their support. We saw a lot of staff here from British Gymnastics um, and you know they've done a lot of work behind the scenes to help us get where we are. And finally, just a quick word on the team as a whole. It's, the future's bright. This is just the beginning. It's, uh, it's incredible. People always say, you know, how good can British Gymnastics be? Um, and I think, you know, with Olympic Games like we've just had, we really do show that there's no limits. Um, we just got to keep believing in ourselves. Uh, you know, you guys need to keep believing in us, uh, that we can do the job. And, uh, you know, there's no reason why in four years' time we can't be winning more medals than we've won. Joel Scott! everyone what it must feel like to go to bed as a gold medalist although you haven't got the gold medal and then you've got to go out the next day and do it again that that must be the maddest feeling ever yeah it is it gives you uh, it gives you a good you know i had a good 36 hours for it all to sink in um which is which is a bit odd uh but uh but yeah i mean standing on that podium at the end of it it does it, it kind of does really make all the hard work worthwhile and Everyone always says it, it's very cliche, but uh, you know, getting that medal is a, it is a very special, special moment. Uh, I see that you travel everywhere with your fan club and your entourage. <laughs> Thanks, ladies and gents. If you want to ever be on TV, all you have to do is wear a really bad suit. Uh, who are these? How did they get in, by the way? It's a lot of you have to come to to be in Team GB. I don't know who they are. I've never seen them before. Have been on television supporting you, some by accident, some not, right? Uh, sorry, what's that? Some of them have been on television yeah. by accident supporting you, is that right? I think well, I don't know, yeah, I, I, I haven't seen too much of the TV, if I'm honest, so I'm not sure if they've been on or not, but 
I'm sure they've, uh, I mean, they've got the magnet suits on, haven't they? So. <laughs>